Marathon, <laughs> lots of walks. There's been lots happening, really, Kelly. You're doing your bit, basically. I, well, yeah, I've got the blisters to prove it, definitely. <laughs> um, yeah, big, big group of us from, from, um, from EastEnders went and uh, formed Barbara's Revolutionaries this year. And thank you to everybody who um, sponsored us, because we raised, I think, collectively 185 thousand pounds remarkable um, amount of money which yeah. is amazing and it's such a fantastic charity and um out of all of the so i suppose biggest killers in the uk dementia and alzheimer's is one of them and it's the most underfunded so every single penny goes towards um, finding a cure there's one in three of us in the uk that's going to develop alzheimer's or dementia so it's a, a massive massive thing and everybody has a story everybody knows somebody who's a family member friend so that's why we got together because of barbara living with it yeah of course and how is she doing kelly when did you last see her it was recent um, actually wasn't it with yeah. your, your little ones went right yeah to see her. did we, we all went out for a lovely little cream tea thing um and um yeah she was on form she's 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 a She's got such a sparky, fun personality. She's completely infectious to be around, and she, you know, she put, puts on a performance, yeah. I, I suppose, when she's with with all of us. Mm -hmm. um, but obviously, she is living with dementia, and it it depends, like day, day to day. You have good days and you have really terrible days, and it's it's tough, mm -hmm. and especially because there is at the moment no cure, cure. You know? and it is it's the friends and family you think of as well isn't it because it's very difficult we see scott who's very oh, he's amazing he's done an incredible job trying to shine more light on this disease and of course to raise money yeah of course and and it's it's just not easy none of it's easy yeah that, that's it that you've like hit the nail on the head it's it's um it doesn't just affect that person it, it affects the whole family how 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 can you protect this person how how can you make their life safe and um yeah, but it's really, it's really tricky. That's why it's so brilliant have, having charities like this who, who are trying to get as much money to 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 find a cure. They yeah. think they're six years away from finding something, um, and also having um, a safety net and some money available to people who, who are really struggling. Um, so the Alzheimer's Society, Dementia UK, are fantastic. Mm. Um, yeah, yeah, no, they're a great bunch. And you, you talk about Barbara's Revolutionaries, this big group of mates, yeah. basically. And, of course, Emma Barton is amongst that. Yeah. Um, and we see her now at the weekends, dressed up on Strictly, looking terribly glamorous. Oh. It's not easy. And I think it's really hard, especially with Ems and her schedule EastEnders. I know that they've spoken about it, but it is brutal and at the moment they're filming all of the, um, the Christmas episodes, so I think she's in quite a lot. Right. So right. to try and... Um, you know, learn the choreography each week, I think is tough, but she's a perfectionist and she's really loving it. And I, I think they were hard on her this week. Yeah, I think they were, but she made it through, so she you did. just have to let it go. And, yeah. and would you do it? Oh my, I, I, I would print off my CV and like, <laughs> put, put it everywhere underneath all the judges. <laughs> really? Yes, yeah, it's, I, I love Strictly Come Dancing. I think it's great. Yeah. Just to learn all those dances. It's something special, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. But although, as I say, I did it many years ago and don't remember one step. But anyway, it was nice in the, in the moment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. what, I, what I wanted to say that, um, was about going back to dementia and Alzheimer's is there's this thing called the Glow Walks coming up. And um, so if anyone wants to get involved, um, it's in March. So it's perfect just after Christmas to start training. And um, you can find out about them on, on the website. It's Glow Walks. OK. I just wanted to just... Absolutely. No, no, no. Do it. Do it. So you're working alongside Idris Elba again? Yes. Bill Bailey. It's, that's not a bad kind of cast there, is it really? Let's I know. Face it, spending your day with those two. I know. With, with a great big perm. A and perm, exactly. Chelsea. It is, it's the dream job. Um, being a bit of Bill Place, my husband, and he's just so funny and gorgeous and, you know, I mean, dr dream second husband, seriously. Yeah. Well, it's called, of course, In the Long Run, and it's, it's sort of loosely based on Idris's life, isn't it, really? And it's, as you say, set in the 80s. It's, it's just it's a, it's a great TV programme. And he is such a force of nature, isn't he, Idris? You just feel the presence of him as he walks into oh. the room. He just sort of seems to make things happen. Yeah. And he does everything. Yeah, you know, it's music, acting, directing. It's like there, there isn't a box that hasn't been ticked. I know, clothing line DJ. I mean, he's, he's a machine. <laughs> he's totally... Is he like that when you're working alongside him then? Do you sort of get that energy from oh, him? Oh, totally. I, I find him incredibly um, inspiring and genuine. And I, 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 think, I, think, I think the guy's brilliant. I re really do. He gets stuff done and... Um, 
He's, he's a dude. Yeah, he is a bit of a dude. Well, look, it's so good to see you again, oh, Kelly. You Send our love to Barbara, obviously, if oh, you're well. going to be seeing her soon. And uh, roll on Strictly. <sighs> hey, you never know. Thanks for that. <laughs>